All right, unheralded hero from the 49ers win over the Saints was one of the biggest guys on the field, their defensive tackle, Hassan Ridgeway. Remember the Alvin Kamara fumble right at the goal line when the ball popped out of his hands like a cork coming out of a champagne bottle? Well, that was thanks to Talanoa Hufunga, and it happened after Dre Greenlaw said that he was thinking about suplexing Alvin Kamara because he just wouldn't go down. He kept on powering forward to the goal line. Well, Hufunga came in like a missile, ball pops up in the air, Jimmy Ward hits it up even higher, and then disaster almost struck for the 49ers. Juwan Johnson, the Saints tight end, was about to make what looked like it would be a relatively easy catch in the end zone. But hustle from Hassan Ridgeway, 310 pounder, didn't need to be there, but then he did need to be there. Hassan Ridgeway barrels in, hits Juwan Johnson, makes sure that Johnson cannot recover the fumble, and because of that, the 49ers were able to recover. It was Dre Greenlaw that got on top of the football. Just awesome effort from the biggest man on the field, and he saved the 49ers' skins. Just imagine how frustrating, how demoralizing it would have been if they had forced that fumble. But if Jawan Johnson had recovered it, made that catch in the end zone to give the Saints a touchdown, it would have been a hairy game. It would have been 13-7 to all of a sudden. 49ers would have lost a lot of momentum. But Hassan Ridgeway made sure that none of that stuff happened. Hassan Ridgeway made sure that the 49ers, with their hustle, would maximize their fumble luck. And, you know, Ridgeway, he's quietly delivered a few pressures here over the past few weeks. Remember, the 49ers are still missing Eric Armstead. They're still missing Javon Kinlaw. So the fact that they're getting quality interior D-line play from some of these reserve guys has been a huge deal for this football team. And yesterday, when you look at that fumble, 49ers had eight players within striking distance of recovering. And eight, eight of their 11 defenders were in the immediate vicinity of the football. And that's called playing with your hair on fire, flying to the ball. And normally we talk about safeties and linebackers playing with their hair on fire. We don't talk about 310 pound defensive tackles doing that. But Hassan Ridgeway was an exception to that rule. And it might've saved the game for the 49ers. So he's been a really good pickup. And I'll leave you with a funny story about Hassan Ridgeway here. By the way, I'm in the DeBose Park dog park. Little spot, only a couple dogs playing today, but this is a fun, fun spot in the middle of the city. You can see it, huh? there's one playing catch right behind me. But uh, Hassan Ridgeway last year was with the Eagles. He hit Jimmy Garoppolo in that week two game against the 49ers. And what happened was that Hassan Ridgeway, when he joined the 49ers, ended up getting a locker right next to Jimmy Garoppolo's, like literally right next to him. And first thing they said to each other, or at least the first thing that Jimmy said to his new teammate was, didn't you hit me last year? And Hassan, just such a quiet, soft-spoken, nice dude, he's like, yeah, I think I did. Sorry about that. And then both of them just had a laugh at their locker. So Garoppolo, Hassan Ridgeway, locker mates, and Hassan Ridgeway, unsung hero for the 49ers against the Saints.